<laughs> hey friends, we're gonna make a colorful lantern. I know summertime is great because at night you can have your lantern and this will be a, a lot of fun for the kids. So all we did was glue this tissue paper on the edges, which is really pretty easy. So you could just use some glue, squirt it on, and then smear it out and add your tissue paper. But I'm thinking now that we've made it, I might want to put my other clear cup on there so that way you don't see the paper edges ruffling. Let me show you what I mean. See like this? So all that's glued on, add that to it. And then you would want to um, go ahead and hole punch. Let's do that now. Let's hole punch the outside one so we can be able to add our handle to it. And when you add your handle, it's so great, you get to decorate it too. So you just slide on those pony beads, uh, anything that you want, and add those, add your handle on there. So it's ready to go with all your pony beads. And then I would say at the very end of this, whenever you've got all this ready to go, if you want to add some pom-poms around the edge to decorate it even more, I think the kids would really think that's cool. A lot of fun. And then here's the little tea light. You can get these at the dollar store. Battery operated tea light. Flip it on. It's hard to see with our bright lights. But the light is on and you would have your very own lantern. Now they might just want to put it in their room and that'd be fine. Matter of fact, it'd be okay to even give them the Bible verse to write on here with the Sharpie, I am the light of the world. Uh, and those type of things when kids get to reinforce their, their craft with a Bible verse is very good. It helps them remember these things are the things we learn in the Bible. So I hope you'll consider making one of these decorated uh, lanterns. You know, a battery operated tea light. It is a great thing. I hope you enjoy.